Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new to my channel, welcome to my channel. In today's video, we're going to be doing a cardio workout. This is part of my summer body challenge. The entire schedule is linked down below. And the way the workout is structured, you're going to be working for 45 seconds and you're going to get a 15 second break. So let's get right into it. And also don't forget to hit that subscribe button and the bell icon so you get all my notifications and never miss a single update from me. We are going to start with lunge step backs. Keep your feet shoulder width apart, back straight, step back with your foot and make sure your knees form a 90 degree angle. Press back up on your front foot and switch legs. Repeat the movement alternating your legs. Speed squats. Stand tall with your feet shoulder width apart and your toes pointing forward. Keeping your torso as upright as you can, push your hips back, bend your knees and lower your body as far as you can. Quickly push yourself back up to the starting position. That's one rep. Repeat moving up and down quickly but under control. Floor touch squat. Start in an upright position, hop, landing with your feet more than shoulder width apart, with the toes pointed outward at a 45 degree angle. As you land, bend at the knees and hips, reaching down to touch the floor with one hand in one fluid motion. Once your hand touches the ground, come back up with a hop, bringing your feet back together, then repeat the motion, touching the floor with the alternate hand. Prisoner stationary shuffle. Stand with your feet hip width apart, your hands behind your head. One foot starts slightly forward, the other slightly back. Hop up and change your foot position. Quickly repeat by switching legs. Prisoner in and out. Stand with your feet hip width apart, your hands behind your head. One foot goes out, then the other one follows. Then bring the first foot in and second follows. So it's out, out, in, in. Open eye, feel the way. 
Kneeling squat, put your hands behind your head and kneel onto the floor one knee at a time. Then come back up into a regular squat position. Do not come all the way into standing and go right back down to kneeling. Squat to alternate oblique crunch. Bring your legs a bit wider than hip width apart. Your hands come behind your head. Lower your body down, bringing your butt way back as though you're going to sit on the chair. Lift your body up and draw your knees to the opposite elbow. Lower back down and switch the knees and elbows. Jumping jack to a squat. Start by performing a jumping jack by jumping your feet wide and hands together. Return to standing and squat. Perform another jumping jack and repeat. Duck walks. The duck walk is a form of movement performed by a low partial squatting position and walking forwards. Maintaining the low stance so when doing this workout you're going to be taking a step forward, remaining in a low squat position and then walk back in the same position. Knee to elbow kick up on the right. Start in a high plank position with your body in a straight line, your palms under your shoulders and your feet shoulder width apart. Bring your right knee close to your left elbow, then to your right elbow and finally extend your right leg behind you and kick back. in the air. 
Switching it to the left side, start in a high plank position with your body in a straight line, your palms under your shoulders and your feet shoulder width apart. Bring your left knee close to your right elbow, then to your left elbow, and finally extend your left leg behind you and kick back. Side plank with knee in on the right. Lie on your side with your palms directly below your shoulders. Lift the hips off the mat, forming a straight line from your ankles to your shoulders and brace your core. While keeping your torso stable, raise your right leg and bring your right knee towards your chest. Pause and then return to the starting position. You can always come down to your elbow if this is too challenging. We will now be switching it to the left side. Lie on your side with your elbows directly below your shoulders. Lift the hips off the mat, forming a straight line from your ankles to your shoulders and brace your core. While keeping your torso stable, raise your left leg and bring your left knee towards your chest. Pause and then return to starting position. You can always come up to your palms if you want to make it more challenging. Plank jack to mountain climber. Start in a high plank with your palms flat on the floor, hands shoulder width apart, shoulders stacked directly above your wrists, legs extended behind you, your cores and glutes engaged. Jump your feet out and in. Try not to let your butt and hips bounce up and down as you jump your feet in. Once your feet are in, hold your plank, pull your right knee into your chest as far as you can, switch legs and back to plank jacks. Grab hip thrust with reach. Start seated on the ground, resting your arms in the reverse bridge walk position with your palms flat on the ground and hands pointed back and slightly out. Squeeze your glutes to lift your hips up off the ground. As you rise up, reach one hand over the opposite shoulder, twisting at the torso, pause, squeezing your core and glutes, avoid arching your back, then return to starting position, repeat on the other side.
last exercise is the crab toe touch. Sit on the floor with your knees bent, place your hands behind you with your fingers facing your body, lift your hips off the mat as you kick your right leg up straight and touch your right foot with your left hand. Lower your leg and arm back to starting position and then repeat the movement with the other hand and leg. Continue alternating sides. Thank you so much for working out with me today guys. I hope you guys will enjoy this workout. My heart rate is definitely up with this workout. This is part of your summer body challenge. The entire schedule is linked down below. Do follow that for best results. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button and also the bell icon so you get all my notifications and never miss a signal workout or an update from me. Until the next video, bye-bye.